the fuck going on, man? See, throw the plug. I can follow me on Instagram at see, throw the plug. S I T O D A P L U G G. Now watch him drop the heat. Gang shit. Stacking up a lot of stuff for the upcoming platform, video, um, upcoming tape that you have coming out. Mm. What's the What's the next move? And what's the What's the name of the tape? Well, the name of the project is Moving Devious. Moving Devious. Right. Right, the reason I picked that name is like in memory of my brother, my fallen brother. He just passed away. Feel me? Just yeah. past summer. Feel me? Like one of our 
miss some pieces to the puzzle. You feel me? Like we need him to get to that next level. Yeah. He's living through us, so I'm just trying to keep his name alive the best way possible. Yeah. So I'm naming the tape moving devious. You feel me? As you can see in the cover art, mm-hmm. look like we in a stool. I'm either looking in a a booth and he's still there with me. You feel me? Or it look like I'm looking in a mirror and I see him like. You feel me? So it's on some shit like that. Like just keep my bro name alive. You know. Um, basically, bro, the next step, I'm just dropping this music. Yeah. I got, like, in my head, I want to put 14 songs on the project. You feel me? But I'm thinking if I want to put 14, I got to have at least 28 recorded. Yeah. Pick the best 14. You feel mm-hmm. me? I don't want to have 14 recorded, bro. I have to. You feel me? Because I feel like my last tape I recorded, I rushed that shit, honestly. You feel yeah. me? I'm glad... The listeners, the people that is in tune with the game, they still, like, took it how they did. But I really recorded that shit, and I'm, like, the big biggest critic, like, critic of my music, yeah. you feel me? Basically, bro, I'm just recording this shit. I'm in the mixing process right now. Got to get everything mixed and mastered. That shit take a lot of time, bro. Yeah, I'm why does that, that take right? so much time, though, bro? I mean, see... I be a mix and master and sister to blow my head off. Like, yo, that is, we hear a different song. Can you hop in the booth, make another song? Like, that shit take mad long. Why that shit take so long? I don't really even know why that shit take so long, bro. When niggas be, I don't know. I was told once, when you mastering, bro, it really be taking like seven days, you feel me? To really yeah. master the song, you gotta do something with the beat, make sure the beat is on, point with vocals, all that, you feel me? So basically, when we be in the stool, bro, we just book these little sessions. They just doing like a calm mix on it. You feel yeah. me? You gotta really have an engineer that know what you're doing. Sit down and really take his time with your shit. Yeah. I done had somebody master my shit, bro, for seven whole days, me and Zay Project, right? What? Seven whole days, bro. After the master, it was sounded worse than it sounded when, like it was natural. You feel me? What like, you mean? It sounded better, just raw. He mastered it. It's like... We had auto tune on certain songs, and now it sounded like no auto tune is on it, so shit is sounded like off key. You feel me? So you didn't like how you, you didn't like how you. I don't know. It. We had to send that shit. Back. <laughs> <laughs> we had to send that shit back, bro. No cap. I think I had to do that shit again. Yeah. Free of charge. <laughs> <laughs> fucked up, man. That yeah, ass fucked up. Damn, that's crazy. So that's, I ain't know. I ain't know how to process. I I didn't know you could send a song back either, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Still in COVID session. Right. COVID season. But yo, speaking about Corona, man, how is how was the the extension of this year, man? How did how did it go for you? A lot of people lost some friends, family, a lot of people lost money, a lot of people lost jobs. How went how went for you during this corona? Did you stay productive? Yeah, I was staying productive, you know. I feel like COVID had its pros and cons. It did build a lot of hustles. I started seeing Yo, all type shit. Started seeing all type of shit. All type of shit, bro. Just shit, bro. That's a fact. But it did definitely. This year was a lot of downfall too, bro. A lot of people was lost. You mm-hmm. feel me? Like I just said, like I just lost one of my people. I thought I would never lose. So it's yeah. like this shit is rough. But we gotta just keep moving through it, bro. We was productive for the most part through the COVID, though. Yeah. I would say. You didn't stop going to the studio now, right? I don't know. I mean, I know some studios, studios was closed. yeah, the shit was like closed down and shit, but... They ain't stop you, though. They ain't stop me. Once they <laughs> got... A matter of fact, that shit probably made me cop the home stool. Oh, <laughs> that shit is wild. Well. That ass. I got the little setup where I could just record, you feel yeah, me, at least. Yeah, whenever you want. Word. That shit just kept me like... So when you do... So why you go to the studios and you got the shit in the crib? My shit in the crib ain't really like... You feel me? It's yeah. just a little shit, bro. You need the experience. Yeah, <laughs> yeah just, feel you, feel you. just the hair, hair shit. And I don't know how to mix down and shit. You feel me? What's this GMN? What is what is GMN, bro? So the GMN, bro, it's really get money, niggas. You feel me? But yeah. for the public <laughs> eye, it's get money nation. It is a label. You feel yeah. me? It is a label. So it's just a it's a group. You feel me? Like I said, bro, it is a label. You feel me? So it's a label. We just working. It's a record label. We trying to just put the music together. We still learning, so we in the midst of still learning. So it's hard to really explain what it is, but it's like basically a few artists on it. Y'all know GM and Z. It's me, C. Throw the plug. Yeah. We the artists that like own the label. Feel me? Our two managers, my son Brand, uh, Brandon Jivy, my son Nettie. Yeah. Feel me? We trying to sign people. We just trying to own our own like everything, bro. Like. 
we don't really know, so it's hard for me to answer this question, like, yes. what it is, but it just started off, like, as a group of friends, you feel me? But we was in tune, loved the music, we seen that we could do something with it, based off, like, the following, and everything, like, how people would perceive in the music, I guess. So now we're just trying to take it to the next level. We still learning, bro, so it's hard for me to really answer that question. But that's what okay. GMN is, man. They know what GMN is, though. If you ask the public, they know what GMN is. <laughs> it's a label, and we're trying to take things to the next level. I'm <laughs> fucking <laughs> 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 What's his name? Yo, you got any music videos that you pushing right now? Yo, you got a, a video that's that that you got some drill shit that niggas is going crazy up here in Mount Vernon for. Uh, I forgot was I think it was with Mula G's I think. Uh, spin block. Yo, that shit hard, yeah, nigga. No cap. Crazy. Yo, but anyway, any any video that you pushing right now or anything that you pushing right now that's going crazy? Shit, right now, bro. The whole gang working. You feel me? Yeah. So basically. Sano John Doe, he about to drop. Yeah. That's another member of the GMN, you yeah. feel me? GMN Zay, he just dropped. He yeah. dropping back to back. He dropped the project. So yeah, he's dropping back to back. Out. Um, damn. Fuck, Drill and Beat. Yeah. And the Deluxe he dropped, so. You feel me? We working, bro. I'm pushing my brothers until I drop. I'm dropping some time. It's coming, bro. I don't got no date yeah. for them, but yeah. I'm about to drop them to get things in order. I'm just pushing, um, but we got Drill and B Deluxe and that first Drill and B, if y'all ain't hear that yet. Yeah. Um, Zay also dropped my story. That was a tape probably two months ago. He flooding the streets, you feel me? Yeah, he going crazy. He keep dropping. Yeah, that's the only shit I'm pushing right now. No vids. I really dropped recently, so. I'm trying to drop some shit soon, though. So what's that shit called? Mula Jiz again? Spin Block. All right, copy. So, yo, this is what we're going to do. It's your game. You already know what's going on. I'm going to go see for the plug. Right to the right of me. We and A.M. Studios. We're going to take a break. We're going to that spin box right now. I'll drop the heat. We'll be right back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know the fucking vibe, man. It's see through the big plug. Big GM and shit. We ain't ducking if it's friction. Once it's up, we up 300 guns. Axel. Axel. Shit me or kid me. You jacking his beat? Two words. Two words, nigga. Spin block. Get the fuck out of here. Outside. Gang, gang. You jacking his beat? Two words. What's that? Spin block, you niggas don't learn. Get shot, my shooters absurd. Red dots, my shooters like bird. Red hot. Red hot, red hot. I fuck out swerve. Dead thought. Dead thought, dead thought. What the fuck did you say? Two words. Triplet. Shots on my dudes, got me feeling like Vic I get close on the op when I'm feeling like Wick I was only like 12 when I took my first stick I was only like 12 when I took my first stick Nick, niggas want beef, don't box Young A on the side Free Rick out the camp, but he up in the nine Free Rick out the camp, but he up in the and free little Steve, that 357, it came with a beam. He got his name up, sending niggas to heaven, no messenger left him on scene. Those niggas can't tame much, parabellum, and we catch him, we stretch him, we tearing the screen. Bow, bow, clearing the scene. Shooters with me like we playing the league. You jacking his beef, two words. What's that? Spin block, you niggas don't learn. Get shot, my shooters absurd. Red dots, my shooters like burr. Red hot, red hot, red hot. I fuck that swerve, dead thought. Dead thought, dead thought. I feel like hot, I'm feeling like Fuego. Fuego. I'm sacking up like it's Legos. Oh, that's a op. Beam on his head, though. Hey. I bet you I'm leaving them dead, though. Fuck a little thought, ain't fucking my bed, though. Treat. We hit the basement instead, though. Fuck a little thought, ain't fucking my bed, though. Hey. We hit the basement instead, though. He hurrying, he dropping, he bleeding out. His mama, she crying, she geeking out. I back up the nine and start tweaking out. On my mama, I slide him to Rico House. To Rico House. On my mama, these niggas is pussy, they don't want no drama. Back up the llama, start blinking like I'm making a rock. Two words. What's that? Spin block, you niggas don't learn. Get shot, my shooters absurd. Red dots, my shooters like bird. Red hot. Red hot, red hot. I fuck that swerve. Dead thought. Dead thought, dead thought. Suck my dick, I got two words. Triplet. I smoke those niggas' mothers. Two words. Suck dick. Got a couple GM niggas in the booth for me. Here we back. You already know what's going on, it's Will Gates, right here at AN Studios, my boy C from the club right next to me, just finished seeing his music video with Moolah G's, 
She got a lot of views on Instagram. She was fired up. Yo, bro, real quick, before we get out of here, I gotta ask you a few more questions, man. What do you see yourself in the next five years? In the next five years, bro, I see myself at the top of the music. Yeah. The music game, you feel me? Um, we just taking it step by step right now, but definitely in the next five years, yeah, I definitely see myself at the top. When I say myself, I mean the whole GMN, though. I don't really speak for myself. The whole camp, you know how we coming. Yeah. We all going to be at the top, bro. We about to take this shit by storm. So, the next five years, that's where I see myself at. All right. Anything you want to work with in particular? Um, I want to work with all the artists that I really fuck with, like, in particular. If I could work with somebody right now, it would be, like, like a lit artist. You feel me? It's my father or some shit. Yeah. But... I really don't want to work with somebody like a boogie. Fuck with a boogie. Yeah. Heavy. Want to fuck with um, fuck with young artists like Rowdy, Lil Baby, yeah, shit like yeah. that. I follow Rowdy. Right, yeah, but up, like up and coming artists, I also want to work with too. Like that I had in mind. You feel me? Like I fuck mm-hmm. with Young Boy, Busy Banks. I fuck with Stunner Gambino. Facts. Like those niggas I listen to. You feel me? So I do some shit. What's up? Facts. That's what's up, bro? I got Stunner Gambino on the. On the show before, um, I want to say a year ago before all this shit, and it's just amazing to see like the growth for all this shit. One, the same thing is happening to you. I see it, bro. Mm-hmm. I see it happening, but my boy Shiva just keep dropping, bro. If you drop, right. then you go ghost, bro. Yeah. Like I hate when you do that shit, bro. I literally, and I'm telling you, as like fuck me being a critic, I'm telling you like let's say fan. Mm-hmm. I I watch your shit, bro. You gotta keep dropping, bro, because I'll be getting right. bored, bro. I'm getting bored listening to the same shit. Mm-hmm. When you drop something, you be like, oh yeah. When you drop a tape, oh yeah. You go ghost for like five months, bro. Right, bro. You yeah, feel yeah. me, bro? That's just, that's just some shit you niggas gotta improve on, bro. Facts. Consistency. Yeah. We definitely been trying to pick up the consistency facts. You yeah. feel me? We definitely gonna keep keep consistent, bro. Stay on it. Mm-hmm. Gonna stay persistent on the shit, too. What's your, what's your opinion about clubs and throwing money and shit, bro? Do you, mm-hmm. do you, do you feel like that's something that niggas have to do to, to be lit? I don't feel like it's something you have to do, but when I'm in this spot, I'll yeah. be wild. I'll be wild, bro, but you don't have to do it to be lit, you feel me? You yeah. lit if you lit, bro. Mm-hmm. I mean, mm-hmm. The nah, only reason I'm asking is because people see that you as you a rapper, they want, you're supposed to perceive your certain image, you Fact. know what I mean? I ain't got fun, bro. I come from, like, this is some shit so they could really understand, bro. I come from like a background where my pops be heavily in my life, you feel me, my pops is official. So he be on some shit, bro. He don't like all this drip, all this. Yeah. <laughs> he don't give a fuck about none of this. But when, when he say we see you with them goggles in your head right now? Bro, when I first caught the goggles, I put on my pops, nigga. Like, this nigga post, 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 he had his time, you feel me, bro? And he was lit back then, you feel yeah. me? He was lit, bro. My son had to deal with Warner Bros and all that, you mm-hmm. feel me? A lot of people don't know that, but they deal with them, got washed away, you feel me? Like, back in the Mount Vernon era with, like, um, Heavy D and shit. Yeah. Like, my pops was heavily in tune, you feel me? Like, facts, YGs back in the day, young gun shit. Yeah. Facts, though, bro. Right. He don't be on that shit, bro, so, like... You want to be lit, bro? You lit. You feel me? You could just be lit. You. You feel me? You don't gotta have the outfit, swag, yes, no, Gucci. Uh, before we get out of here, man, any advice you give to the youngest looking up to you? Because I know people be going up to you like, yo, see through. Right. Yo, yeah. yeah. I never bother, bro. Yo. I be trying to tell you guys, man. Yeah. I got a song too. It's called Paranoia. Coming on the movie, Devious. Okay. I said the youngest. I be trying to motivate. Tell them stay in school, but they be trying to raise a murder rate. They rather play with tools. No cap, bro. I'm just trying to tell a young man. Stay focused, bro. Say it again. Say it again. Hold on. One time. One time. I said the youngest. I be trying to motivate. Tell them stay in school, but they be trying to raise the murder rate. They rather play with tools. You don't make it out the hood. You make the news. Hope a lot trying to take the safest out. We rather break the rules. Uh huh. Also, when outside the vacant house, we trying to make shit move. You know who in tune. You know how we on it. You feel me? And I'm I'm talking on some third party shit, like bro. That's the mindset of like the young boys, like. You know how we on it, like niggas be on some cocky shit, and it's like, you don't even gotta be like that, bro. You feel me? Like, and niggas be probably thinking I'm a cocky nigga, bro. I have my moments, you feel me? But I'm really trying to be like down to earth and shit. So for the youngins, bro, I want them to stay focused, bro. Don't, 
Feel me? I'm picking no guns. So nah, fuck that. Stay focused, nigga. <laughs> no cap. Stay focused, young and not nigga. We here, man. Hey, yo, see, this is why we're okay. Drop the heat, my boy. See through the plug. To the right of me, Moving Deviants coming out Moving real, real soon. Soon, man. I know that shit. Yo, where they can find you on all platforms? You can find me on, um, on Instagram at C Throw the Plug. That's S I T O D A P L U G G. Two G's. C Throw the Plug, man. I'm on iTunes and shit. Same name. You can type in that shit. Same word. RP Devontae Lane. I mean, yeah, rest in peace, Devontae Lane. Don't need long with Devontae Lane. Let's just never die, my brother. That's a fact. Yo, as well, get you already know what's going on. See the fuck to the Miami A Studios. We out here. Bow!